Oh, howdy everybody, and welcome back to Holy Cow and Taster Kevin. So I'm taking over this here show, and I was in charge today. Uh, I don't think you're in charge today. In fact, I really don't think the truth has been in you. The other day you said my brother sent an email. No, he did not send an email. Uh, I think you made that up, and uh, you're not in charge. I think you're making that up. Oh, 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 I was telling the truth. I don't think the truth is in you. Oh, no, it's your hand. Oh, whatever. Hey, holy cow, I'm glad you're here today, and today is a very special day. Oh, it sure is. It's Valentine's Day. You know, it's got me cards for each and every one of my girly friends. And you know what? Some of this is going to be surprised. Why are these girls going to be surprised? Because they don't know that they's my girlfriend yet. Oh, that may be a, a, a surprise that they're not ready for. But, you know, you, if you're going to give Valentine cards, you need to give them to everyone in your class. Oh, well, I ain't going to do that. Why not? Because some of it's kind of mean, and some of it's kind of nasty. And there's a couple in that they, they smell funny. And then there is that one, and he, we call him a bully. You know, he's like a cow. Uh, uh, an internet cow, a uh, vol e, oh brother. Well, you know what? We need to be nice to everybody, no matter what, because that's what God wants us to do. Well, God's never been in my classroom. Uh, yes, he has, and he sees what you've been doing when you're in the classroom, when you're in the hallway, and when you're in other places. You know, you like the transfer's office? Were you there again? Well, we'll have to talk about that a little later. Well, holy cow. Now, I have a verse for today as we think about Valentine's Day. You always get a good verse because every verse of the dial is a good one. You're right on that. And it says in Matthew chapter 22, verses 37 through 39, Love the Lord your God. Oh, I know this with all your heart, with all your mind, with all your soul, uh, with everything you got. And love your neighbor as yourself. Yeah, so we need to show love to those people that may not be as nice to us and send them a Valentine card as well. Well, I want to send a Valentine rock, and I'm going to send it to you. Why would you send a Valentine rock? It's going to go, it's going to go air nail, not email. I was going to send it air nail. You mean you're going to throw a rock at somebody? Uh-huh. And what if you miss? Look out, Linda, here it comes. Uh, that's not a good idea. And what if that mean person were to pick that rock up and throw it back at you. Well, I was going to be ready, and I was going to duck. Well, I think you better not send a rock. I think you need to do something of kindness and niceness. Oh, really? Yes, because when we do things that are nice, even to those people that are mean, we're reflecting Jesus in our heart, and we're treating others as we would want to be treated, and we're not doing it to them. We're doing it as unto God. Well, all righty, I was going to go change those e those, those Valentine cards and make them all look dirty and, and write my name real nice and do a good job. That's right. And you know, put some candy with it. Oh, that's an even better idea. Well, I'll try to leave the wrappers unwrapped open. Uh, that's an even better idea. And I think I got one more good idea. What was that? Say goodbye, holy cow. Goodbye, holy cow. You all take care and dust your hair and dust your teeth. You only got to dust the ones you got in a cake. Goodbye, Kevin's mama. I love you. All right, we love you all. Have a happy Valentine's Day.